God, it's freaking hot today. You know, this U-Bike is one of the best bike sharing system in the world. And all you have to do is buy this kind of easy card and register. You just have to register your mobile phone using the kiosk. Then you can start cruising around in Taipei city like a champ. It's really easy to get a good cup of coffee in Taiwan. Oh, that is too hot. Oh. So every year during this time, it really makes me want to hit the beach. Talking about the beaches in Taiwan, I think the most famous and popular one are in Kandin. So I think today I'm gonna introduce a bit of Kandin to you guys. Kandin is in the southernmost part of Taiwan. <laughs> this area circled by Blue Line is Kandy National Park. Let's take a look. It is Taiwan's first national park, covering the southernmost area of Taiwan, the Henchun Peninsula. This national park is well known for its tropical climate and sunshine. People come here mainly to hit the beach and play all kinds of water activities. But what they usually don't know is that Kandy National Park is also a perfect place for economical tour and hiking. Of course, for cyclists, there are tons of routes for us to cycle on. I personally love the stretch starting from Bai Sha Bay to Wan Li Tong, where is my favorite place to watch the sunset. So, what about the sunrise? Well, the Long Pan Park it is. From there, you can overlook the stunning coast of the Pacific Ocean. Just cycle down the highway number 26 towards the east. After passing the southernmost point of Taiwan, the Erwan B Lighthouse, you can see the Long Pan Park on your right hand side. This section is also considered the most scenic highway in Taiwan. But today, I'm going to take you to a secret route called the Menma Low Mountain Trail, where it's perfect for off road mountain biking. The word Menma Low literally means can't find a way in Taiwanese. A couple of months ago, my friend Guan Lin and I tried to find a way in, but failed. A few weeks later, we visited there again and were so determined to tackle this challenge. First, we went to Donggang Fishery Harbor to buy a whole bunch of seafood, then had a barbecue feast in Bai Sha Bay Resort, which was phenomenal. Then, the next morning, we set out to explore this secret cycle trail. We cycled all the way to Hunchun Township, then entered County Road number 200. Soon after, we arrived at the intersection of the Menmalo Trail. But still, we hit a dead end. <笑>我現在計劃就進去晃一晃<笑> 也是摔死<笑> 我們終於到了 <笑> Mountain is situated in the southernmost part of the Central Mountain Range. It's about 300 meters above sea level. It was the historic trail for transporting sisal, which was an important catch crop in Henchun. Since the roads here were so complicated, even the residents often got lost after dark. The most famous attraction here was this couple trees, but they were blown down by a typhoon. As I said, this place is perfect for mountain biking. Of course, we can't wait to go for a ride!
afternoon hour, we were so exhausted and decided to call it a day. Then we went to buy my favorite energy drink. It is just the best thing ever invented by Taiwan. You know, now in Tokyo, people have to wait in line for six hours to get one of these. You think you might as well fly to Taiwan? Okay, that's it for today. I hope you liked today's episode. This is just a small portion of Kandy National Park because there are so many things to do over there. So if you want to know any information about Kandy National Park, or if you want to know anything about Taiwan, or anything about me and my story, please comment down below and uh, hit the like button if you like this video. And consider to subscribe because it really helps me a lot. Okay, I'll see you in the next video. Peace. I'm in love, yeah I'm stepping